The shepherd boy aimed his gun down the mountain towards a large bus to test how far the bullet could travel. Tragically, one of the slumbering female passengers on board was struck by the bullet. The nearby husband heard the commotion and approached for closer inspection, only to find that Susan's shoulder had been drenched in crimson. The man was shouting at the driver to stop the car. The passengers in the car were thrown into a state of panic, fearing that they had come under a terrorist attack. But there was no commotion outside. Richard intended to bring his wife to the hospital. However, the tour guide informed him that the nearest hospital was a five-hour drive away. As a result, the bus had to make a U-turn and travel towards the closest village. After a rough journey, they found a barefoot doctor in the village. Richard hugged Susan tightly and raced towards the village doctor's house. Upon examining Susan, the doctor delivered grim news that her collarbone had been punctured and she needed immediate surgery to avoid excessive blood loss in a fatal outcome. He then took out a sterilized black iron needle.